Hey guys, Brian here. I want to make a really quick video and show you how I um, add uh, a switch to a three pole chain lights. Well, it was really two, but I added a third light. So the problem was was that each of these lights had a pole chain, and you had the pole chain, and you have to pull the chain to every single light when you wanted light, which is really inconvenient. So I decided that I was to replace that and put in a, a switch. So I installed the switch. This is my sneak peek. Anyway, um. Light on, so the switch is here, the wire goes up and over into the first light box of the, of the circuit. Now, I want to explain to you guys how I wire this up. So, I use a 14.3. It is code now to have a switch in, to have a neutral in the box, but in a basement, unfinished basement, it's okay to use a 14.2, but I use a 14.3, so I could have a neutral. So, that's what works here. So, we have three wires where our feet come in from the panel. We have the feed going out to that light switch, and we have a feed coming in for, from our switch. Now, what we do is you can pause the video how it's done. So, all the neutrals, all the whites are tied together. That's it. It's very easy. Now, what you do is you take the hot coming from the panel and splice it with the black coming from the switch. Okay? Did you get that? Splice it from the switch. Now, you take the red wire coming from the switch, and you splice that to your next light, to your next light um, on the circuit, and, the and then this light here for the um, for, for this pole chain light. And all the grounds are tied together just like the neutral. It's very simple. That way you can go from light fixture to light fixture. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the light box to show you what's inside there. Okay, so I opened up the switch box. It's very simple. So the 14.3 comes in. What we have here, guys, is the neutral. This is the neutral. As you can see, I just stripped it back and I put a wire net on it. Because that's not needed in a regular switch like this. So as you can see, when I flip the switch, light turns on. Up the switch off. It goes off. Now, what I did here, is all I did, it's very simple. So the bare copper goes to the green ground screw. And then you add the um, the two blacks to the two screws. Very simple. Now, as you can see, and that's fairly important, I added... A lot of slack in the cable. That is very important, guys. You need a lot of slack in the cable by code. And just so it's easy to free to work with. So the installation comes in. Um, it's basically it. it's a fairly easy project. Um, you know, I would suggest you just use the screws. Don't use, you know, the back step. So I hope this, guys, was helpful for you. It's a very year basement project. So see ya. Bye-bye.